have a new baby, but are they legally married? Please welcome Patch and Kyla from Days of Our Lives. By the way, Mary Beth Evans and Stephen Nichols. Now, they have just a patch. Going. <laughs> Wait. I have to. Okay. Oh, well. <laughs> That's all you get. That's all you get. <laughs> badge, badge, badge. What's happened to you? Sally, Sally, Sally. Baby, listen. <laughs> uh, Mary Beth and I, Kayla and I, are chasing. We're back together. We're, yeah. we're in Australia chasing after the, uh, the nanny who Streetwise Patch hired. <laughs> who's kidnapped, who has kidnapped our baby. And the running gag is, the dingo got our baby. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, oh, yeah. every other scene. Yeah, we're in Australia, Sally. Well, Not well, really. well. Question. Question. My question is for Steve and Kayla. You have such a wonderful relationship on screen, and obviously you have to be good friends. I wonder if you are good friends off screen, and if your families do things together, and if you are good friends off screen as well. We're very good friends. In fact, today I brought my little children with me, and on the airplane, I'm with my friend over here talking like this, and Steven's in the chairs over here with the baby, and my son, and he's talking. <laughs> no, we're great friends. Now, wait a minute. How old is that baby? Eight weeks. Yeah. Yesterday. Yeah. Or Friday. <laughs> baby. She's a doll. And the other child, not to be It's two and, and a half. Uh, I want to know for the men, how do you handle those uh, steamy and sexy uh, situations? You get yourselves in bed and then get out and go home. How do you do that? <laughs> it, makes, it makes going home even better. <laughs> My wife puts me in metal Work to your strength. <laughs> yes. Mary Beth, Stephen, I would like to introduce you to a very special fan. You nervous? <laughs> This is Susan Shade. She is from Kensington, Connecticut. She has been watching the show since she was 10 years old. She's now 53. <laughs> no? Oh, I'm sorry. She's been watching the show since she was 10 years old, and we have brought her all the way across the country to meet her, meet wow. you. Would you mind if we took a picture? I'm teasing, of course, about the age. There you got it. The biggest fan. We're going to take a break. More soap opera madness when we return. Oh, okay, now, Kayla. Now, you push. Got push now, baby. Go, 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 go. You can do it. You can do it, girl. Yes, you can. Yes, Here comes can. the head. Yes, you can. What's happening? A girl. Beautiful, healthy, perfect baby girl. That's a clip yeah, from Days of Our Lives. We're ah. talking to daytime's hottest couple. Do you feel, Please Mary Beth, that it's a mirror of reality? In my life, it sure has been. It has been. all these babies and everything, which is my real life. And uh -huh. So for me, it has been, yes. Do the rest of you think the soaps are a mirror of reality? I think if you're on a soap for a long time, <laughs> it's, it's, it's going to mirror your reality to a great degree. I mean, if you're a weight pumper, that's what you're going to be on a show, yeah. too, to a degree. Yeah, but they want a good story. that you have to offer, yeah. they will use it on so the show. I have you not been blind and impotent in real life. Yes, I'm a, very, I'm a big fan of Stephen Keller from Days of Our Lives. And I was wondering, how did, how did you get into acting? I mean, did it just come natural, or, I mean, how did, how did it all come for you? Well, uh, this, is a, this is a better story, <clears throat> let him tell you. <laughs> I can tell you about Mary Beth. <laughs> we forget so many no, times. I, uh, I was actually, I came to Los Angeles in 1971, and I was going to be a monk. And I'm serious, and the day that the, uh, just, you I was cook? waiting, I was, <laughs> on, I was on a waiting list uh, to get into this particular order. And when the guy came to me and said, it's your turn to go, I said to him, I don't think so. I think I'm going to be an actor instead. <laughs> and I went and studied acting. I didn't really say that to him, but I immediately went into school and, and uh, studied acting. Is there any an comparison actor. at all? There's a lot of discipline in both. Yeah, I would think so. Gentlemen up there at the microphone, go, uh, sir. We'll 
Okay, back to our microphone up there. Yes, this is for Steve and Kayla. Uh, you've been a part of my family since the year I got married, and I really enjoyed your show. I noticed that Bo and Hope are back in the show. Is this a permanent situation? What, what was the last part? Is yeah. this permanent? It's permanent? for him, not for her. Uh, I'm not supposed that? to tell those I things. I say that. Uh, yeah, I think they're going to be around a while. Show. They're going to be around a while. This show's canceled, my dear. Is it? Well, well welcome to San Diego. We really love you here. Thank you very much. Everybody has so many questions. I wanted... This is for the whole panel. I'd like to know, when you have a problem off the screen, uh, do you ever ask yourself what your character would do? <laughs> no, never. Oh, God, no. No, no wait a minute. No, Everybody no. on the uh, panel has uh, children. Am I correct? You're the only one? And you're about ready to take yeah. one out of the oven or something That's, like that? Yeah. Okay. I've got two on TV, though. How do you find time for the kids, guys? Mm. You oh, know, people... Every, oh, go ahead. Go ahead, No, Brad. go on. No, here. please, Brad. You don't do anything else. <laughs> you work, and then you're with your family. But, you know, people are under the illusion that people on soaps work five days a week. And, and some of these characters do, but others don't. Most of us probably average three days a week over the whole year. So you have a lot of time with your kids. It's... It's actually show business's best job for raising a family. Patch, what were you going to say? It yeah. is true because well, it's I agree with what Brad jobs. said. And also, I'm sorry, honey. just go ahead, please. <laughs> no, I just <laughs> please. Isn't there a problem with dad and mom as a celebrity? Do you think that? Don't you think it's harder to have children to bring up the children when you're a known face? It's all relative. Those kids no. don't. I have four kids in four different colleges. They don't care. Really. And yeah, mine don't know. Mine today were like, do we have to watch you today? Can we yeah. go to Shamu? Exactly right. you know? right. We were at the zoo, and, and these fans were coming around and asking for autographs, and my little boy was standing there, and he just said, what are you doing here? <laughs> he, they don't get it, really, when yeah. they're small. They don't understand what's but going do you on. That, does that affect the way you work? What? The way you work? The if it, you problem, have a problem off the set. Yeah. Well, you work so much, you have some bad days, you know, and you just have to get through it. So, yeah, I guess it affects, I don't know. Does it affect you, Stephen? It's your turn. Oh, thanks. Brad. <laughs> Thank you for asking, Brad. Uh, Hello, Steve. Actually, uh... can I answer that for you? Yes. <laughs> See please, the power. Please, Mary Beth, answer that. It affects him. She, she keeps me it up. It affects him until tape, the and then when he gets the tape, he does work. okay. This is my best friend at work, and when she's not there, when she was just recently on her maternity leave, I was a mess at work. I need her around to. Keep my spirits up, you know, because it does get a little bit tough sometimes. Really, I'm serious. 